What's good everybody? I am back again with another video and we have the Varsity call-ups here today. Now guys, it's going to be an interesting video because the freshmen, they played well, the JV, they played well, the Varsity, they played well. But it's time to go ahead and make those decisions on who gets called up and who gets sent down. Now with the Varsity, first person sent down, Sean Marion. We're gonna send him down, we're bringing up Vince Carter. That's the first switch. So boom, that is done. And now we have to go make more decisions. Now I was reading the comments, I saw all the crazy ones. Hey, get this guy, get this guy, Vucci Main, you're gone. And we're gonna bring up LeBron James. So LeBron James is up and Vucci Main is actually down. But we're not finished. It's gonna get really interesting here. This was a tough decision for me. You see the card I'm on right now. His name popped up a lot. Maybe he was top three. But in the situation that I have right now with the JV, I saw his name. I saw Ginobili. And at this moment, we're gonna send Ginobili back down. And you're probably wondering why? Well guys, I already I only have two point guards on the varsity and I've already got three well actually four on the JV so we don't want to put five point guards on the JV you know what I mean so that was the tiebreaker I believe in this decision I was making and who are we calling up in this situation we are going to call up look at my list Carmelo Anthony so Carmelo is up and Ginobili's back down Really, inter uh, really interesting situation there. So now, you see the new varsity. We have our new varsity right here. Damian Lillard survives, but I am going to adjust the lineup and give John Wall the start. And we are going to run, we're gonna replace KD with LeBron in the lineup. So it's gonna be interesting. We finally got T-Mac and, and and Vince finally together. We got the cousins working together. And it's gonna be really interesting to see how those lineups pan out. We got Kobe and Shaq. And yeah, that's how it's gonna go here with the varsity. The JV, we're not done. We gotta make some people to send down. We gotta send some people down. We sent three up, now it's their turn to get three people sent down. First guy sent down, Kevin Love. Kevin Love's being sent down, but who's coming up? We are going to call up Mr. Boogie, the Boogie Man, Boogie Cousins. He gets called up, and we are going to send down Kevin Love. So we're good right there. That's the first of the JV freshman call up situation. Now, with four point guards, I saw you guys say Gary Payton has to go down. Gary Payton goes down, and we're bringing up D Wade. So D Wade made it through the cuts. And I was thinking about clearing house with this whole freshman team because they didn't play well. So yeah, that is the next situation as I'm looking at the next one right here. As Gary Payton is going to be a new point guard here on the freshman squad again. And last but not least, we have to make one more and that person is Gerald Wallace sent down and we are going to call up, who is it? Mr. Money. Money Mullen. Mullen is up. So here's our new lineup. We're going to adjust it. We got Boogie at the five. We got who's at our four. We're going to play Blake at the four. We got to get a shooting guard. Who's going to be? We're going to go with we're going to go with Ginobili at the, the time because we have Wade and Mullen playing together and Penny played okay. I believe Penny up there. I'm gonna give Kyrie more minutes this game. He's gonna hop up in front of the big O, even though, even though it's supposed to be the same minutes. If you don't believe me, look at this. See how this is? It's supposed to be the same minutes, but the game does not allow it for some reason. They give guys more minutes than others. And yeah, this is our lineups right here for this call up of the JV squad. So the JV is looking brand new, got a whole new rotation it seems, and it's time for the freshmen. Now we know Kevin Love is safe. Wait, let me replace him out real quick. And I forgot who it was, Gerald Wallace, yeah. 
So now we know Kevin Love is safe, we know Gerald Wallace is safe, and we know Gary Payton is safe. The rest, no one is safe. First person we are going to call up. Let's go over here to it. Rudy Gay, Rudy Gay, Rudy Gobert, you're gone. I'm gonna give Jonas Valanciunas a chance. He's an 85 center, so I'm gonna give him a chance. I said I was gonna give him a chance last call up. Point guard, oh boy. How am I going to do this? Check this out, guys. I went shopping and I saw some cars you guys wanted. And I was I promised that the guy that sent me MT. I told you I was gonna get it. So yes, we do now have Ruby Lamarcus Aldridge. So we're gonna add him to the collection and boom, 1,000 cards as we are going to get a Diamond James Harden. So yeah, let me go ahead and send all these guys over. You saw them, but let's go ahead and make those changes first before we do anything. I'm going to give some Emerald players some chance. Some Emerald PGs. Mike Conley steps in, and Nate. He played okay, but he has so many turnovers every time he plays. And that is going to be Brandon Knight. Now I'm giving Brandon Knight a chance because I actually know how to shoot with Brandon Knight. I say this right now, but once we get online, I bet I start missing everything. That's another call up. Okay, we keep going. Our test really didn't get any minutes, so I owe him some more. And we're gonna keep Ruby Lamarcus Aldridge. And he's going to take whose spot? We're gonna let him take Mark Eaton's spot. No, we don't even have a center. No, keep that back, keep that back. We're gonna leave him and we're gonna let Ruby Lamarcus Aldridge take the big ticket spot. KG, another one of those veterans that have been around forever, and he is now gone from the freshman squad. He's been around since JV varsity days before there was even a freshman squad. So now we need a, another position, and who else did I pick up? Yep, here we go. Iceman, and eh, nice knowing you. Nice knowing you, Iceman. I'm sorry, I just couldn't figure your shot out. And I tried hard. I mean, he, he's got one of those Glenn Rice type releases, and it's just tough to shoot in a situation. Don't kill me, guys, as we bring up Paul Pierce, the truth. Now, Paul Pierce is there, and I'm actually going to go and put this guy on, in, in, on the auction block, this George Gervin, and get some kind of MT back for the time being. And let's see, we got Pierce, Aldridge, Brandon Knight, Conley, Valanchunas. Am I missing someone? Hmm, am I missing someone? That is correct. We are calling him now in the reward collection. Oh yeah, also, there was a locker code that came out on 2K, so I got a free legendary pass locker code. Let's see what we get in that as well while we got this video popping. I forgot all about that. Craig Elo, okay, Craig Elo, somebody I didn't have, so that's cool. We get a free card. And it's time to go get the big man, the one we really need, and that is Diamond James Harden. Fear the beard. So there's only one card left on the checklist, and that's a long way away. I don't even know if I'm gonna reach that, and that's Allen Iverson. But we do get Diamond James Harden for this collection. Got 1,000 cards, and he's going to take Chandler Parsons' spot, because we don't have a, a shooting guard off the bench. So here we go, he's gonna replace Chandler Parsons. My diamonds, my diamonds are everything. But I'm also going to do something else. I am going to adjust the lineup and make him our starting shooting guard. Jordan's coming off the bench. 92 overall card. I gotta get the all-star edition if that's the case. But a 92 is not that bad. Look at the stats. 94 drive and layup. Whew, this card could be scary if you know how to play with him. So this, this is the card you get. And let's check his badges out. I didn't do that. His badges right now are Acrobat, Hop Stepper. Oh, I'm gonna get that limitless range up and unfazed and it'll be scary. I'll probably touch some of these badges later on. But yes, you see the squad. Valanchunas gets the start at center. And that's what we're gonna roll with, guys, as our new lineup is here with the freshman. I'm giving Jordan another chance. And I think we are good to go. We got offense, defense, and I'm gonna change these jerseys up while we're here. And that playbook is definitely gone. You guys, if you've been watching the videos, you know I have been ranting about the playbooks. 
That's right, close my eyes or open my eyes or whatever. Stop. Nope, I don't want yellow because somebody might wear yellow. We'll, we'll go with the Pistons. And we are going to go with which jerseys here today? Orlando. Hey, I like that. And I'm actually going to run the Orlando Magic Playbook because I ran it real well. And we're going to switch the arena up. Verizon Center. And we... No, we're not going to get the Magic logo again. Let's do this again. It is going to be the 76 or so it's cool. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know in the comment section what you think about the call-up situation. And, uh, yeah, we got all different types of blends of cards. We got gold, rubies, emeralds, onyxes, sapphires. I like it when we mix it up. Diamonds. So, hey, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please drop a like. Subscribe if you are new to the channel. Comment down below on the call-up situation and players that you may want to see in the future. And let's get this video over with.